quote, I have never had any concerns and complaints related to the interaction <coughs> between and Samuel and Fishes, an agronomist or a resident, and that's the guy who leads the Standing Scientific Committee on Atlantic Salmon Management. This Beaver ecotourism can greatly benefit rural communities. Agus Field Centre works with 160 island schools, delivering field work to up to 7,000 school pupils every year. Our adult programmes handle 750 one-week visitors each year. The better the beaver you know, which is, refers to if you are managing conflicts with, uh, with beavers within an area, if you've got a relatively um, high population density and you remove beavers, either by lethal control or by trapping, that empty territory will quickly be recolonized by other beavers. So if you're removing... Uh, I'm coming to the view, really, that, that food production is uh, almost just a byproduct of good environmental land management. And that's a service that landowners can provide to the public without globalization pressure. You might get corn cheaper from Canada, you might get your steak cheaper from Argentina, but if you want to do something for flooding protection in Germany, you have to do it here. They're helping to build climate resilient communities, and Beaver can play a massive part in that conversation, and it's that conversation that we need to be building on early now. So that when beavers arrive in the National Park, they're not going to be seen as a problem that needs managing, but they're going to be seen as an asset that we need capitalising on. In 2019, beavers were finally granted um, official protected status, um, and the quote on there is from Rosanna Cunningham, which I think we welcomed, along with many other people, um, that she recognised the values beavers would bring to the Scottish environment.